welcome back to my channel so today's video is going to be a kind of like a purge i'm purging my kids toys christmas is coming up and i wanted to kind of get rid of anything that doesn't work anything that is malfunction anything i don't see them playing with just to like kind of make room for the new stuff and not have everything so overwhelming this bin that i'm showing you is from amazon i link it below in my amazon store if you don't see it directly in the link just go over to my amazon store and it will be there um it comes with a partition but i didn't want to separate their toys because they share the same toys pretty much so I just took the partition in and put it in the middle of the box so it could be a little bit more sturdy in the middle. But um, it's, this box is pretty good. It's a bit huge. If you have a lot of toys and stuff, then it's perfect. That pad is from Dollar Tree. Uh, I just bought a whole pack of those and I was just going through spraying the toys now with Lysol. And then I just went in. And just wipe the Lysol just to disinfect the toys. Um, I tried to get this um, done pretty much like whenever it's the season change. Like spring cleaning, before school, and before the new year. Just clean out their stuff. Making sure everything is in working order. And get rid of whatever I don't see them playing with. If it's broken and I cannot get, fix it. Or if it's a car that doesn't move. Or it's, the remote's not working. I tossed it. So some of the things you'll see I'm putting on the floor. That's not going to go back in there. Um, I'm not donating currently. Because in New York... With COVID, they're not taking donations of a lot of stuff. So, a lot of stuff you'll see, I just put it to the side and I will be tossing them or I put it in the box. And then on top of it, a lot of these toys you'll see are repetitive because these are McDonald's toys. And they get McDonald's every Friday, as you guys know or may not know. But, yeah, so I'm just going to let you guys listen to some music and get through me organizing and disinfecting these toys if you're not already subscribed to my channel please don't forget to like comment and subscribe i do read all my comments and i do respond to my comments so don't be shy i or you can find me over on instagram and send me a dm if you're too shy to leave it in in on um youtube i do accept all friends requests or my page is in private. I don't know. But send me a message or leave a comment. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel. As I do have a lot of new content coming up. And trust me. You guys don't want to miss that. I am going to give you guys some great organizational tips. And especially becoming minimalistic. So all these little itty bitty toys. I try to keep them in like a bin. And separated from the trucks and stuff so it's easier for them to reach and not have to dig into it. So you see I have like this little clear box that I got from Family Dollar. It was like $3 and I just put the smaller toys in that. Those toys that you see I'm laying to the side those are all McDonald's toys. All McDonald's toys. So they're not going to go back in. I'm going to toss all of them and here comes Carter trying to pick up something and try to hide it just so he could keep it this is the little clear bin i was talking about for um back to school i found it and i just keep like those little blocks in them building blocks in them and also just like the smaller toys that um that i do know that they play with smaller cars that they'll take with them on the road or any little knickknacks that come with any toys, I try to keep it in that little bin so it's not at the bottom and they don't have to go digging for all of them. So 
so all the toys in this box will be going in the garbage as i stated i'm not able to donate right now because in new york with the covid it's they're not taking donations of everything of anything and i already have clothes under the day bed in the living room that i'm storing as i don't want to toss those because a lot of them are new and I feel like it'll be put to better use being donated than tossed. And then the toys, I feel like it's not that important. So I feel more comfortable tossing those than the clothes. So I definitely am holding on to the clothes for the donation. So I'm just going to move on to cleaning up and straightening up the place. Um, just to get everything in a much neater order in the living room. It's not, I'm not deep cleaning, I'm just making up the bed, cleaning up, because at this point, I think it was like the end of the day, so he had school and everything else, and made a mess in there, so I'm just cleaning up after them, and getting everything put in the right place. I don't know what you know yet, I've realized, and I'm dying to tell you Thank you for clicking on this video and if you've made it this far and you enjoy the content that I do share on my channel please don't forget to like comment and subscribe to my channel as you guys know if you've comment before I do respond to every single comment and if you like my video I am so grateful liking lets me know that you like the content and I should keep going and keep producing these content I do appreciate all the support, so please don't forget to comment and click the like button and make sure you're subscribed and turn on your notification bell if not, because I do have a lot of new content coming, especially with the new year. I'm telling you, it's about to go down. I'm about to clean this house from top to bottom, and you don't want to miss that because I'm going to share a lot of organization tips also to help in the new year making it a smoother transition and show you how i'm transitioning my family into a minimalistic lifestyle i don't know what you know yet no i've realized and i'm dying to